It's the busiest travel week of the year and passengers are hoping to avoid cancellations or delays. Our Eddie Dowd reports from Honolulu's airport. We've definitely seen demand throughout the day, even starting early morning for those catching those first flights out. Hawaiian Airlines tells us demand seems to be on pace with last year. And as you can see with me, as you can see behind me, people are coming and going to the airport. Tomorrow for Thanksgiving Day, Hawaiian says it expects around 12,000 people to travel on inter-island flights alone. Now, there are some potential storms forecasted for the eastern part of the continental U.S. Hawaiian told us it is fully staffed and ready to prepare for any potential impacts or disruptions, but travelers should check for any delays. Now, some told us the busiest travel day of the year wasn't as bad as they thought it would be. Uh, it was a pretty full flight. It wasn't too, too bad. There was some traffic getting into the airport, but um, luckily I have like TSA pre-check, and so the line was pretty smooth. The Department of Transportation says about 60% of parking stalls are currently filled up at the airport, but that's expected to increase tonight, and it recommends people get dropped off or take a ride share to the airport. Now, it may not seem too busy right now, but that's expected to change tonight for those red-eye flights that people will be taking to get to Thanksgiving Day. Reporting at the Daniel K. Inouye International Airport, Eddie Dowd, Hawaii News Now. All right.